Remote play on the PS5 is a really cool feature, but there's a couple things you need to make sure that you set so that you can enable remote play from the start. Hey everyone, thanks so much for joining me. And in today's video, I'm gonna share with you how to enable that setting so that you can remote play right away. As always, if you enjoy this video and found it helpful, please be sure to hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe so that you can always stay up to date on my latest helpful PlayStation videos just like these. Let's get right into it. So there's a couple things that you wanna make sure that you have set on in order to enable remote play for the PlayStation 5. What you first wanna do is you wanna go up to where the gear icon is on the top right corner, and that's actually the settings menu. When you go into the settings menu, you wanna go down at first to where it says system. Once you go into the system menu, this is where the two menus are that you need to make sure the options are on so that you can enable remote play. The first menu you want to go down to is called Power Saving. And then from there, you want to actually go into what says Features Available in Rest Mode. And what this menu does is it allows you to set certain settings to on or off so that while your PlayStation 5 is in rest mode, you'll be able to fine tune the power consumption of your unit. In order to turn on remote play for the PS5, you want to make sure that two things are on in order to make that happen. And that's down here where it says stay connected to the internet and enable turning on PS5 from the network. Those two things will allow you to not just have your PS5 connected to your network at all times, but also allow you to turn on your PS5 from wherever you are as the PS5 is running on your network in rest mode. The next setting that you wanna turn on is super important. And that's if you go back to where the system menu is once again, and you wanna go down to where it says remote play. Now this is something that really surprised me and I'm not sure that if it's the same for everybody when they turn on their PlayStation 5 and set it up for the first time, but for me, enable remote play as a setting was off by default. So in order to enable remote play, you wanna make sure that that feature is set to on or else you won't be able to enable the remote play feature when you're away from your PlayStation 5 console while it's in rest mode. Did you know that the PlayStation 5 DualSense controller not only has a speaker built inside of it, but also a microphone that you can talk into so you can chat with friends when you're gaming online multiplayer? I recently published a video and I'll leave that for you right here and in the description below showing you how to adjust your microphone and speaker levels so that you can dial in both the output and the input of the microphone and speaker of the DualSense controller perfectly. As always, if you enjoy this video and found it helpful, please be sure to hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe so you can always stay up to date on my latest helpful PlayStation videos just like these. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you on the next video.